Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we're going to be organizing Marie Kondo style. It is what everybody is talking about. Everybody wants to organize like Marie Kondo. I live in a very small space and the amount of stuff that we have just kind of clutters everything up and it doesn't bring joy into my life. I feel like I get crankier when I get home because everything is just so cluttered and disorganized. So I've been watching um, her show and I just got inspired and little by little I've been doing little things here and there I mean if you look at my living room I'm not gonna show you but if you look at my living room it is full of stuff right now because all of the kids clothes um, I'm redoing their room that's gonna be another video all of the kids clothes are on the couches and it's like oh my god like just clutter and disorganization will make you so unhappy but as we do it everything kind of feels fresher and just better you don't need all this stuff so in today's video i am going to be decluttering marie kondo style my hair products all right since i live in a small space i have three places where i keep my hair products i don't have like just the one shelf i'm working on organizing everything so hopefully soon they'll all have their own place but i'm hoping that since i declutter everything um I'm only going to need the one place to put everything. So I bought these two baskets at Dollar Tree. Look at that. I don't recommend them. They're super flimsy. Not great storage at all. Um, so I'm going to get rid of them. I'm pretty sure. Maybe I'll keep this one because this one's not in bad shape. But this one, ugh. So I keep it in here and here. And I keep these two baskets in my clothing closet. And the next area is the closet by the bathroom. It's kind of like my cleaning supply um, storage and my linen storage. And I don't know, it just has everything in there. But one shelf I have full of hair products. And I feel like that makes it really easy for me to grab since I usually do my hair in the bathroom. Don't judge me, guys. This is the closet. It's super disorganized. But this is the shelf with all the hair products. It's really dark in here because there's no light. But it's right next to the bathroom, so I can easily come here and get my like hair masks or whatever. And it's not organized in any way, so I really need help with this. Um, but yeah, this whole shelf is full. And it's a deep shelf, so it, there's a pretty good amount of stuff in there. And then some of the... There was so much stuff that I had to use the top shelf as well. That one's not completely full. It only like the beginning part of it has hair products. The back has other stuff. So, like, I have everything in here. Look cooking pans everything but yeah so I'm gonna go take all of these out put them over there with the other products and we are going to declutter Marie Kondo style so this is everything from the closet and the bins let's ignore this little section right here this is just for my vanity like my face stuff but and this but yeah this is everything from the closet and the bins and it's actually not that much I mean I've seen some people that have so much product it's not that much right it's gonna be a lot less because I'm getting rid of some of the stuff so that I can make room for some new things so decluttering Marie Kondo style she does the same process with clothes and what she says is put everything in a pile so you can see everything that you have and then grab every item one by one and whatever doesn't spark joy in your life then you get rid of. So I'm gonna do the same thing with these hair products. Go one by one really quickly um, so we don't make this video super long because there's a lot of products here. And I'm gonna get rid of the ones that don't spark joy for me or my hair. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go one by one with each of these products. If it sparks joy in my life, I'll put it in one little bucket which is gonna go into the closet as I organize it. And if it doesn't spark joy in my life or my hair's life, I'm gonna put it in the other buckets. Now depending on how full it is or what it is i'll either give it away or throw it away i'll give it away um to like my cousins and stuff they love when i give them hair stuff first thing is this garnier whole blends replenishing conditioner i love it it's actually super full because i only use it a couple of times so this is going in my keep it sparks joy i like how it detangles my hair I'm putting it here Next is the Hask Charcoal Purifying Dry Shampoo. I don't like dry shampoo. This is actually for my cousin. She already claimed it. Um, so it's going in the giveaway box. 
Not Your Mother's Clean Freak Purifying Conditioner. It doesn't spark joy in my life. I actually got this for my daughter's hair. It doesn't spark joy in her hair's life either, so this is going away. This is the Novex uh, Deep Conditioner. It doesn't spark joy for me at all. That's why it's still here. I've had it for a long time. Bye. Actually, I'm supposed to thank the products as well, so next one I'll thank. Uh, this is the Uncle Funky's Daughter Midnight Train Leave-In Conditioner. I've had it for a long time. It does not spark joy for me. That's why I have not used it as much. Thank you for your services. Bye. Affigy Curlific Curl Definer. I think I, I, I got this at a product uh, swap, so I don't know. I mean, I only used it like once, but I don't know. Sorry. Ooh, my Diva Curl No Poo Decadence uh, Conditioner. Actually, this is the cleanser. Yes, you sparked joy in my life. I have a lot of you left, so you are staying. This is actually not a product. This is just a little spray bottle with water. The product is gone, but I'm going to get rid of it because... This is my Shea Moisture Daily Hydration Styling Gel. It does spark joy in my life, and I don't have that much left. So, you're staying. Oh, this is actually empty. It sparks joy in my life, but it's empty, so I'm going to throw it out. Why are you in the closet if you're empty? This is the Aussie 3-Minute Miracle Moist Deep Conditioner. If you don't know about it, you should get to know it better because it's cheap and it's good. Eden Body Works Hydration Serum. It's almost gone. It doesn't spark as much joy as I thought it did, so bye. True by Made Beautiful. This is the Quench Curl Refresher. I don't really refresh my curls. This is going. Thank you so much for your services. Bye. Novix Mystic, Mystic Black Leave-In Leave Leave Conditioner. No. Bye. Ah, why do I have empty products in my stash? This is the Garnier Fructis Curl Sculpt Conditioning Cream Gel. I love this stuff. It's cheap. It's really good. Oh my god. I need to go get some more. This is completely empty. Like There's not even a little bit left in there. Bye. This is a shower gel. You're staying. Why are you in the hair products? Uh, this is the Uncle Funky's Daughter Glossy Finishing Hair Polish. I like this. You're staying. Thank you. Thirsty Hair Natural Nourishing Conditioner. There's only a little bit left in here. It doesn't spark as much joy as it did before, so bye. Ah, Shea Moisture Coconut Hibiscus Hold and Shine Moisture Mist. Yes, I love this stuff. You're staying, and it smells so good. Silicone Free Miracle Styler Leave-In Treatment from Shea Moisture. Definite, yes. Oh, this is my Curl Mix uh, Leave-In Conditioner, and this is the Avocado one for moisture. There's the tiniest bit left. I'm going to keep it. Most of the products that have a tiny bit left, I'm trying to get rid of just to clear space. But I love this stuff, and this stuff is expensive, so I'm trying to keep it because... I just love it. Oh, when winter cranberry mint cleansing conditioner. I love my when cleansing conditioner, so it is staying. I actually have two more when uh, cleansing conditioners here, so these are staying as well. These are brand new. Uh, African Pride Moisture Miracle Honey and Coconut Oil Moisture and Shine Shampoo. And eh, it doesn't spark as much joy, but it's a shampoo, and I'm gonna keep it because my daughter has so much hair. She goes through. So so much shampoo and conditioner, it's crazy. Dippity do curls, dippity do girls with curls um, gel. I'm keeping you because I haven't tried it. I got it a product swap and I haven't tried it yet, so I need to keep it. I don't know if it sparks joy in my life yet. Diva Curl Melt into Moisture. This stuff sparks so much joy into my hair and my curls, and I need to get a refill soon because it's almost done, but I love it, so it is staying. Let me put this down. Uh, Diva Curl One Condition Decadence. This is the conditioner, and I only have a little bit left, but I'm gonna keep it because it sparks joy in my life. This is the Mark Anthony Bye Bye Frizz Humidity Shield Hairspray. I have not used this. I got this um, at an event to try, so I'm gonna keep it just so I can try it. I don't really use sprays like that, but maybe for like an updo. <sighs> this sparks so much joy in my life. This is the Tropic Isle Living Jamaican Black Castor Oil Daily Hair Growth Leave 
in conditioning mist. I love this stuff. It'll leave your hair so soft. This is the Eden Body Works Natural Cleansing Co-Wash. It doesn't spark joy in my life. I don't know that I like co-washes that much. Bye. Thank you for your services. Ooh. This is the Trey Lux Curl and Renew Restore Gentle Cleansing Rinse, the 4-in-1 Hydration Cream. These are new products that I just got and I haven't tried. There's one more. This is the Curl Styling Serum. I haven't tried these, so these are staying in my stash so I can try them and make a video for you guys. Yes. My Wen 319 Hair and Body Dry Oil Intensive Treatment. I love this stuff. Sparks joy in my life and in my skin and my hair. Love it. This is the Marc Anthony Bye Bye Frizz Blow Dry Cream. Now when I got this, the lady told me, well, you can use it on your curls. It actually works really well for your curls. I didn't try it on myself, but my daughter, it kind of leaves her hair really soft and nice. So I use this on her. I do not blow dry her hair. It's not, I don't use it for the purpose that it was meant to be used, but it sparks joy in her hair's life. So we're keeping you. This is the Uncle Funky's Daughter Rich and Funky Moisturizing Cleanser. Yes, you spark joy. The Garnier Fructis Style Curl Renew Reactivating Milk Spray. I like to use this on my daughter's hair, so yes, we are keeping you. Ooh. Garnier Fructis Curl Nourish Buttercream Leave-In Treatment. Yes, we love this stuff. And the Garnier products are so cheap. Like, yes, get some. Cantu Shea Butter Grow Strong Strengthening Treatment. I use this like once. I don't know. And it doesn't spark joy. So bye. It's so full too. Thank you for your services. Cake the Wave Maker. I made a video on this. I don't like it. I actually have someone that I gave the products to. So I'm going to give her this as well. Siba <sighs> Curl Arc Angel Gel. I love this stuff. Yes. Keeping it. Not Your Mother's All Eyes on Me 10 in 1 Hair Protector. Hair Perfector, sorry. This is for my daughter. She, her, her hair likes it, so we're keeping it. Curls Blueberry Bliss. Blueberry and Coconut Hair Milk. We are keeping this. We love it. Yes. G Natural Herbal Hair and Body Oil. No. Bye. Thank you. Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie. Uh, come on. I cannot say no to this. This is the OG stuff. Everybody that is a curly girl should know. This is the real MVP. Yes. We're keeping it. Briani Curl Defining Cream. There's like the tiniest bit left in here. This is really old, so I am getting rid of it. Thank you very much. I actually really like that product, but there's like nothing left in there. Righteous Roots Oil. Um, I cannot get rid of this. So this is like my number one love. My Aussie Instant Freeze Gel. Yes, this is really good, especially in the summer. Um, I only have a little left, but this is really good. And it's cheap. And oh my God, you will get the best hold ever. Uh, Mark Anthony Bye Bye Frizz 8 in 1 Serum. Doesn't spark joy in my life or my daughter's hair. So bye. Thank you. Uncle Funky's Daughter Defunk Hair Refresher Tonic. Now, I got rid of a hair refresher because I don't refresh my hair. But, OMG, like, this smells so good. I can't get rid of it. I love it. And it's almost done. And I need to get more because the smell of this is amazing. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Next. Thank you. Next. Uh, this is my jojoba oil. And it's almost done. I'm getting rid of it because... Thank you, next. This is part of my new Trey Lux products. This is the Untie the Knot Nourishing Leave-In Conditioner. I haven't tried it yet. This is in my trying pile. So you're staying. Mm, African Pride Moisture Miracle Honey Chocolate and Coconut Oil Nourish and Restore Conditioner. It did not spark joy in my life. But since it's a conditioner, you should see the amount of conditioner that my daughter goes through. So I'm keeping this so she could go through it. Like whatever. But she goes through so much conditioner. Whew, we're almost done actually look at that that's not that bad let me go a little bit faster this is my pop curl purple rain um color for my hair i'm gonna keep it because yes inasi 
uh, Naturals Rock Your Curls Curl Enhancing Cream. I'm going to keep it. It's not that much left, but I actually really like this product. Yes, it's very thick, so it's really good for the winter time. This is the Cream of Nature Hydrating Curling Cream. I got it at a product swap. I didn't like it that much. Thank you. Next. Shea Moisture Curl Stretch Pudding. Thank you. Next. This is actually pretty full. I got it at a uh, at an event in a goodie bag. No, I don't like that line. I love Shea Moisture, but that one I don't like. And this is the leave-in or rinse out conditioner. Um, debating whether I should keep it because my daughter goes through conditioner really good. I'm going to keep it for the conditioner and give it to her, but I don't like that line. Uncle Funky's Daughter Thirsty Curls Leave-In Curl Revitalizer. I don't like spray leave-ins like this, and it broke, and thank you. Next. This is my WEN Cleansing Conditioner. I already kept the other one of these. Yes, we're keeping this. I love it. Cantu Moisturizing Curl Activator Cream. I love this stuff. It's so cheap, too. It's like 7 bucks, and get you some. Really good. Curl Mix, more Curl Mix. This is the flaxseed gel. And yes, we're keeping it because this stuff is amazing. And I actually have more products here. This is the Soft and Flaxseed Gel, the Moisture Flaxseed Gel with Lavender, the Moisturizing uh, Leave-In Conditioner, the Conditioner, regular conditioner, and the Shampoo. So we're keeping all the Curl Mix products because, yes, Curl Mix is life. Another Shea Moisture 10 in 1 uh, Silicone Free Miracle Styler Leave in Treatment. This stuff is really good. It has marshmallow root. Yes. Talia Waji, the Gray Detangler Leave in Conditioner and Cold Wash. I thought this stuff would be better. Uh, it didn't wow me, and it's only a little bit left. So thank you. Next. These are some of my oils, and this is the Tropic Isle Living. I need to get a new one because the, the wrapper is almost gone, and it's almost completely done. This is the Strong Roots Red Pimental Hair Growth Oil. Amazing stuff. I love it. This is the Black Castor Oil Hair Growth Oil. I love that this one has this little, you know, I love when they have that because it's so easy to just put on. Yes, you spark joy. I love you. This is the African Pride Moisture Miracle five essential oils i haven't really tried this one so i'm going to keep it just because i'm running low on oils and yes jenner beauty swirl curls gel styler love this stuff but it's like like this much so i'm gonna thank you bye thirsty hair natural leave-in uh conditioning serum thank you next Shea Moisture, Manuka Honey, and Yogurt Hydrate and Repair Multi Action Leave-In. I have a video on this line. Pretty good. I like it, but look at that. There's like nothing there. Thank you. Next. This is my Diva Curl Super Stretch. I can never get rid of this, even if it only has a little. Actually, this this is pretty. This is a pretty good amount in there. I can get a couple more wash and goes out of this. I love this stuff. Yes, Diva Curl. Yes. Shea Moisture, Manuka Honey, and Yogurt, Hydrate and Repair Split End Balm. I have not found a use for this. I do not have split ends. And even if I did, like, this just, I don't know. Like, no. I am going to put it in the bye-bye pile. Uh, Eco Slay Hot Sauce for your hair. It, it's actually supposed to be really good, but I just, it's so messy. I tried to use it one time, and it was so messy that I just, thank you. Next, bye. Sorry. I don't like messy stuff. Novex shampoo conditioner. Thank you. Next. I'm actually put off by all of my Novex products because I've seen some terrible things happen to some people's hair and they just don't wow me anyways anymore. So this is their coconut oil infused shampoo. Bye. More Diva Curl. This is their styling cream. I've never used this. I just got it. It's brand new. I am so excited to try it because I love the curl stretch and they're supposed to be kind of similar. Yes, Diva Curl, you are amazing. This is the Thirsty Hair Natural Sh Natural Nourishing Shampoo. Um, I think I made a video on this. They're pretty good, but there's like nothing left in here. So, bye. 
It's my Diva Curl Leave-In Decadence Leave-In Conditioner. I love this stuff. It's only a little bit I need to refill, but yes, it is staying. Women to Women Natural Conditioner. It's conditioner. We love conditioner in this house, and this stuff is supposed to be amazing. I haven't tried this one. I'm still in the wrapper and closed, so it is staying. Moisture Miracle from African Pride Coconut Milk and Honey Leave-In Conditioner. It's a spray leave-in conditioner. I didn't, I tried this I think like once on my hair. It's kind of oily. I used it on my daughter's hair. That's why it's so little bit left. Thank you. Next. It's Mark Anthony Bye Bye Frizz Leave-In Conditioner. My daughter's hair actually loves this line, I think, because most of their products from this Mark Anthony line work really good on her hair. So this is staying. This is the old, another OG, like I love this stuff. This is like the first time I used this years and years ago. It was the first time I realized that my curls could be nice, beautiful little ringlets. This is the Blueberry Bliss Curl Control Jelly. Love it, this bottle's looking hip, but you are staying in my stash. And we're almost done. Now, I hate little sample packets and like bottles. I mean, it's better when they're bottles because they're easier. I hate like packets. I usually get rid of them. I always take them and say, okay, I'm going to use them, but I usually get rid of them. Um, this is the Rizos Curls, and Rizos Curls is really good. I actually use these, but, oh, this is the deep conditioner. I haven't used the deep conditioner. I'm going to keep the deep conditioner. This is almost done, so thank you, next. This is the Curl Defining Cream that's almost done. It got, I got like one use out of this. Thank you, next. They're pretty good products, really good products, but I don't like the little bottles. This is the hydrating shampoo. It's almost done. Thank you. Next. Bounce curl gel in this tiny bottle. They didn't, they didn't like, I wasn't able to really tell if I liked it or not because it's like the tiniest thing. Thank you. Next. Another curl defining cream. That's almost done. Thank you. Next. So I'm going to keep the deep conditioner because I haven't tried it. Then I have this co-wash cleansing conditioner from True Buy Me Beautiful. Thank you next guys this brand i'm on a really tight budget so i haven't been buying as much stuff but when i have the funds i am going to go buy some of their things fortified naturals find them on instagram this is their hydrating leave-in conditioner now i'm trying to preserve it and i just told you i hate these little bottles but oh my god this is so hydrating you need i just need to try more of their stuff because if this i just speechless i love it I just made a video on this. This is the Strictly Curls line. And this is the... What is it? This is the Styling Jelly, the Smoothie Cream, and the Coconut Oil. Now, coconut oil I am keeping. I also have a Shea Moisture 100% coconut oil. These are just 100% coconut oil. I'm keeping them. I don't use them on my hair. This is for, like, my body, you know, to stay moisturized. Love it. I'm glad that I have a lot of it. So that's staying. The styling gel and the smoothie cream actually worked really good, so these are staying as well. This is the Garnier Fructis. They came out with these pretty recently. They're kind of brand newish. I've used them probably once or twice. The jelly, um, the shaping jelly, and the hydrating butter. I think I'm going to keep them. I don't know that they spark as much joy as I thought that they did when I first used them. Um, but I'm going to keep them around just to keep trying. And that's it. Ah, that's everything. Thank you guys so much for decluttering with me. Let me show you. Now I have a mess of stuff, but this is all of the stuff that I am either throwing away or giving away. And there's a little bit right here. These are some things that work for my daughter's hair that I'm keeping. And then these right here, I'm going to go and organize my closet. And it's actually not that much, so it shouldn't be too bad. Now I will have just the one shelf full of stuff and some space for some new things. So this is my shelf after. It definitely looks way better. Not the best organization, but I tried. And it looks so much cleaner, neater, so much better. So much better. Thank you guys so much for watching me declutter Marie Kondo style. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Go ahead, go declutter your home. You'll see. I hope that I inspired you guys to kind of minimalize. Not really minimalistic because that's still a lot of stuff. But 
Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, please leave it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.